Hey guys, welcome back to No Catchy Name. It's me, Ella. Today is uh, Thursday, the 25th. You know what that means? March, April, May, June, July, August. Nine months until Christmas. All right, anyways, I got some happy, happy mail Boop, right here. I wanted to share it with you guys because it's I got a lot all at once and I want to share it so I can put it away where it goes. Jesse's back there playing <laughs> Minecraft, so I'm trying to keep the TV out of the view. Anyways, yeah, so I got, um, let's see here, I got a package of some fabric that I did a swap with someone with. I got a card, I got a gift from Amazon, and I also got a gift with someone that I met recently, but uh, I can't announce who that was until later date. <laughs> Anyways, so here's my card, and it is from Rebecca in Indiana, and the, um, the envelope, she's got little uh, bunny stickers on. Aren't they cute? They're so cute. <laughs> my nails are red. I was gifted a um, gel nail kit <laughs> uh, where you, you paint them and you use the light to dry them. And this is the second time I've used it. <laughs> the first time I used like a clear nail polish with glitter on it just to see if I could do it without messing it up. And so today I did them in red. I'm gonna hold them back because they're not that good looking because um, I'm not good at it. <laughs> But they dry so fast and I love it. But anyways, they're red. <laughs> so here's the card that came in that envelope. It's a cute Easter card. Really pretty. Look at the bunny. <laughs> Did I say? Yeah, it was Rebecca. And then she wrote me a nice note in there. So thank you, Rebecca, for that. Just is in there clicking the stuff. All right, this fabric, I swapped a piece of fabric with someone and they sent me this fabric. You know, I swapped. <laughs> Her name was Cheryl. Uh, I can't remember what state she lived in. What did I say? I think it was one of the Carolinas. I'm not sure. <laughs> so, um, this is a fat quarter with cupcakes on it. Really cute. I'm going to be using a bunch of my fat quarters um, to make Notion pouches with sometime this month in April. i got to get some more uh, interfacing. I don't have any for the Notion pouches that I make. Anyways, then there's this piece of llama or alpaca. I'm not sure what those are. Really cute. This is big enough to make a project bag with. I could probably make a tote bag out of it. Or a drawstring bag. I don't know. Just whatever I feel like making. <laughs> and then there's also this piece. It's kind of folded weird. This is like a whole yard, it seems like. Yeah, this is a yard. Fold it nicer. It's all messed up. There you go. It's really pretty black and red and white print really pretty bags and a lot of people like black and red so uh those will be bags eventually <clears throat> okay so next i got this one in the mail uh off of my amazon wish list i do have some amazon wish lists and they're mostly for um me <laughs> to go back and look at stuff that i looked at you know because i like to put stuff in there and then not buy it <laughs> and wait a while to see if i still want it and also, I put I have Jesse one for things to buy for him. I have one for house. I have one with the crochet books that I want. I have a bunch of them. <laughs> got like four or five wish lists. Um, and uh, every now and then people ask me if I have one, so I do link it in the description box below my videos. But there's no pressure at all. I just leave it in there because uh, I've had people ask me a few times. But anyways, this is from I think it's Deanna. He's making noises. Um, she left a comment saying that she wanted to. Um, buy me something just uh for for me being so helpful and uh all that and it was really sweet and i really appreciate it so she went on to my wish list i got the little note here i always try to keep these notes with the gift <laughs> and she bought me this book right here it's called snuggle and play crochet <laughs> See, right there? okay to make sure he's wearing pants <laughs> It's got amigurumi patterns and then how to make them into loveys. It's got a few different ones. Here's the back of the book. Duck, frog, uh, mouse, zebra, fox, monkey. I think that might be it. Oh no, there's a rhinoceros and a cow. There goes the cow and the rhinoceros. I don't know how many's in here. I didn't, oh, that looks like a hippo right there. I didn't count them. What does it say? Oh, it says 40. <laughs> 40 amigurumi patterns for lovey security blankets and matching toys. So, oh, and there's a pig. What else? Okay. 
the beginning of it has the different blankets and it's got different shaped ones and then it's got the toys oh there's a little girl so let's see there's a bear a bunny a dog a cat oh okay so a uh, zebra <laughs> I forgot what that was called rhinoceros giraffe a uh, hippo it's kind of glary a frog I like that frog oh Liam my sheep a panda and all these you can make into lovies the cow. The cow's so cute. Cows are super popular here. Duck. Pig. Oh, right there. Oh my gosh. Oh, my finger's hurting. We got a mouse. There. What else is in here? Fox. Monkey. I'm having a hard time holding it. The girl. It's just called girl. I'm sure there's a boy too. There's a girl. Yep, right there. Boy. You can change the skin tones and the hair and stuff if you want to. And yeah, that's the last one. The boy's the last one. That is an adorable book. I'm definitely going to be making some of these. Um, those, oh, they're so cute. <laughs> But yeah, and it came in one of those Amazon gift bags. I always keep these and use them as gift bags for the holidays and stuff. So I've got a good little stock of these now. It's really pretty. <laughs> Alright, let me put this back in there so I don't forget who bought me that book. Stick it in there. Alright, the last thing is I met up with another YouTuber, but I have to keep it a secret until they get done on their journey. Um, and she bought me some, uh, or she gifted me some gifts. I gifted her some gifts also. I made her a bag and I gifted her some yarn. But she gifted me some stickers. I love stickers. Really cute. We got like a llamas and guitars because of Devin. <laughs> and little cactus. Just really cute little stickers. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> and then she gifted this for um, Jesse. It's one of those flying discs. Uh, these work really well. We got one gifted to us from Shell at Shell Shell Crochet. <laughs> and uh, we play with it all the time. I don't even know where it's at because we play with so much. It's somewhere in his toys. So now we got another one. It looks like Captain America's shield, kind of. She gave me this uh, shadow box kit. And it's got a llama in it. And it says time to lounge. But, you know, you could put any, you, you could do anything you wanted to it. Add an extra. So it's a shadow box. So that'll be fun. And then lastly, she gave me this book called Squirrel Picnic presents the big acorn race a story with crochet patterns and projects so it's a book it's got like a story in it but it also has patterns throughout it of i guess the squirrels and squirrel accessories <laughs> oh my gosh was that a garland what was that i seen that i seen it i know i seen it I don't know when I would hang that up, but that is fall time maybe. I could make these or you know, like fall colors. Yeah, that's gonna happen. So yeah, that's my little pile of happy mail. I just I noticed the pile was getting pretty big, so I wanted to um, share it so that people who gifted it gifted things to me knew that I got their um, gifts and also because it's fun to share. Uh, you know when I get new books and new fabrics and stuff. I actually have a pile right here woo, of drawstring bags. They're completely done except the. Um, Drawstrings, I gotta run them. That's why they're all laying. <laughs> I got all the strings up here. Let's see. I'll flip through them real quick. <laughs> uh, these are gonna come up. Today's Thursday. Probably Saturday. I'll put them in the shop. Saturday or Sunday. Whenever I get around to it. But there's two of each of them. And they're just drawstring bags. So, really pretty galaxy print. And it's glittery, but it's not the kind of glitter that comes off. It's stuck on there good stack these right there and then these really adorable puppies oh look at them <laughs> okay 
right, puppies, puppies. The next one is horses. That's really pretty. And then I love this one. This is one of my favorite ones this time. It's a really pretty mermaid print, but the colors are just really beautiful. I love those colors. And I love this one too this time. <laughs> this is like a atlas print. It's really pretty. Pretty. I just, I just love the way it looks. It's just very pretty. <laughs> uh, I also love this one. <laughs> I like a lot of the prints this time. This is. Woo! <laughs> It's got like uh, it's black background with neon stars on it and it's got the glitter that doesn't come off and it's just really pretty and vibrant i like it and then there's these really pretty um feathers that are in like uh what is it called midwestern what is it called is it midwestern tex-mex those colors have <laughs> like the middle midwest <laughs> i don't know what it's called and i love this one too because i love animals and this is just like a jungle print. It's got all kinds of jungle animals on it. Elephant, zebra, gorillas, tigers, pandas. Cool. Is that a koala? That's not a koala. Is that a koala? <laughs> kind of out of place if it's a koala. <laughs> uh, giraffe. What else is on there? There's a bird. And then there's this other one that's kind of with the... Um, I can't remember what the name is, but it's like... <clears throat> travel like a travel print <laughs> really pretty colors and then I've had this fabric before <laughs> but it's really cute Ooh. it's like a farm print it's got horses and there's cows I think yeah where are they yeah up here <laughs> cows in a barn really pretty farmy print and then I got this print because I absolutely love growing plants I know a lot of people love gardening so it's like a garden print a bunch of different things you can grow Jesse's playing. Whoops. And then I've had this print before too. It is chickens and roosters. And then the last print I've also had before is like a, a beachy uh, seashell themed one. Really pretty. So these are all drawstring bags that will be in the shop sometime this weekend. <laughs> Uh, whenever I get around to put the drawstrings in and take pictures of them and making the listings, just all that stuff. I finished sewing them today, so I just need to get them completely done. I'll probably work on that tomorrow. Put the drawstrings in, taking all the photos, making the listings. So they'll probably pop up on Saturday in the Etsy shop sometime. <laughs> sometime Saturday. But yeah, so thank you to everyone who sent me something. Again, it's never uh, expected or required or anything like that, but I do love it. And my Easter card, where is it at? It's on the stack somewhere. Where did you go? Alright, there it is. I'm going to put that in my living room so I can look at it. <laughs> and uh, I love getting cards or anything. <laughs> but um, I love it. I've been getting all kinds of holiday cards from people. Because usually, you know, before I did YouTube, I was the only person who celebrated every holiday <laughs> in my area, my family, you know. But now other people celebrate with me. So I get Easter and Valentine's Day and St. Patrick's Day and all kinds of cards, you know. Anyways, I'm going to put that in my living room so I can enjoy it. And i got to put the rest of this stuff up. And i got to work on these bags. But I'm going to do that tomorrow. So I'm going to go ahead and hop off here. I will see you guys tomorrow, Friday, the 26th, <laughs> for a No Kitchen episode. i got a ton of stuff to share with you guys. Um, more than I thought. <laughs> uh, but i got like five or six finished objects. And i got uh, at least one new whip, unless I sit down and do something else today. Um, yeah, I think that's everything. <laughs> so I'm going to hop off here, and I will see you guys in another video. Bye, guys.